tomorrow morning we are going out in the floating heights. We have two of them and in front of us now we have some beautiful lakes. It is the first time for both of us on this location so everything is new. Oh we can see the lake from here. Oh, that looks good. Should we go and have a look from the from the yeah. roof? Yeah, let's just have, see if we can see anything. That was nice, everything is set up and we are ready for tomorrow. This location is brilliant. I reckon there are around 30, 40 small lakes. Yeah. What is Turl in English? Oh. Oh, this place, is, all these small lakes are created because back in the time they digged up, you know, soil for burning and stuff like that. And now it is just nature basically untouched and we hear so many birds and we have seen some, seen some birds on the lakes and tomorrow we have brought our two uh, floating heights and the first thing in the morning is to get them ready, pumped up, camouflaged and then we are going out in one of these lakes that surround our little camp now to try our luck with some bird photography. And for me, I think it's two years since I've been out of mine. You have used yours a little more. Yeah. And we are just desperate to, to come out. We actually plan on going up north, close to where I live, but there's like a storm hitting the west coast. And then we just took our chance, drew down here, and now we're ready. So yeah, first thing tomorrow, coffee on the kettle, breakfast, preparing the blinds. <laughs> And then we are heading out to do, hopefully, some bird photography for a while. See you tomorrow. <laughs> First taker. Yeah. Mm. Det her er godt. Og så er der ikke en vind. Det her. Det er helt perfekt. <laughs> Det er helt perfekt. Godt. Godt. Ej, hvor er det skønt her. Ja. Up, just to yeah, avoid the rain getting in, destroying our morning coffee. It has been raining all night, but we have been sleeping a good 
very good sleep and a very dry sleep. It was just clearing up, but then rain started again. So now it's time to finish the coffee and then prepare the photo blinds. Now we are so ready to get in the water to hopefully get some bird photos. Simon is going in first and then I go in and then I'll just leave this camera here and let it run. And uh, then we hope we can share some of this experience with you. I have my phone to film and Simon has an action cam. So hopefully we'll get something. Ready? Let's go. I can take the camera. And then. Let's see. No birds now, but uh, I might be lucky. Time to leave the camera behind and. Uh, I'll go in here, have a look. Looks really good. Yeah. See you when we get back. There's a bird two or three hundred meters from here and uh, yeah, <laughs> there's no reason to tell you that I'm on my way to that. Ooh. Shit, it's deep. I have to turn off the phone. I get back where I can reach the bottom. <sighs> yeah.
was really nice. It's the first time I'm photographing that bird from the floating height, but I've also used this very, very little, too little, and I'm going to use it much more because this is fun. Simon is just over there, so I'm going to catch up with him. Jeg skal ikke med at klippe den. Så fik jeg udlagt det klip. That was a really nice trip. We have been paddling around in these two boats for some hours now. It's afternoon and I think we are both really, really hungry. And um, we don't know the English name of the birds, but there was particularly one that was really, really beautiful and nice to photograph. It, uh, it would, it's uh, in Danish, it's top at but don't understand that. So it has a, a red eyes and a long pointy beak. And then it would, yeah, I'll show you the photos and then you probably know what it is. It was just amazing to see the breeding birds. Um, you can hear them right here. And uh, yeah, I'm not that good at English uh, terms of the birds, but, uh, but there was, quite a lot out there and it was uh, yeah really really nice to to faffle around with them That was a really, really, really nice trip with the floating heights. Now Simon and I are going through hundreds and hundreds of photos. Hopefully some of them are good. Fire in the oven over there and soon we'll go and have some dinner. And now we're just enjoying a cup of coffee and relaxing after yeah, some great days. I hope you enjoyed being on this trip with us and uh, see you out there. <laughs>